When I was a schoolboy coming home from school, I thought I saw a bull raining around the hills and mount. Steady hoop, steady hoop, steady hollering around the merry street. And a ring, ting, ting, and a ting, 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 and a through the way, a bow, wow, wow, and a moo, 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 and a heap of people that I do know. Oh, through the way we'd run, play ball, oh, through the way we'd run. <laughs> I thought about this uh, after I got through shooting the last video. Well, it started to rain, started to turn into a bit of a rip snorter, so it made me move from the position I was in, and now... I'm in a different position. I'm able to stay a little drier now. But the rain is steady coming down. As you can see. Enjoy. Just like me. <laughs> but anyway, what I wanted to say was I found these YouTubers on, on YouTube there's a veteran YouTuber in this village, a Kenyan village, and he's been very successful. I believe it's over the last past seven years, he's become very, very successful. And uh, he came home, he went home to a village, to uh, on a vacation on a break from making videos, from traveling the world. And making videos and while he was there this young lady handed him a note he called himself himself I am Mara Myra Mara I am Mara I am underscore Mara he's doing a wonderful work a wonderful job there in that village the Kenyan village this young lady handed him a note after after about three days of carrying a note she handed him a note and uh she needed i think it was like thirty dollars to go to be able to return to school so she could grow up and have some success but anyway he ended up reading that letter on camera which I thought was a very wise decision because as he read that note from this young lady, I think she's like 18 years old, I believe. When he read that note, his, his uh, faithful subscribers saw what was in the note and they decided they wanted to help with this young lady and what she was going through. And so he ended up uh, traveling to her family's home and they found out and the, the, the subscribers, they all, well, well, Mara, he decided to donate or some of some of his subscribers wanted to help her and her family. They needed a peat latrine terribly bad. I mean, it was such a uh, it was in such bad shape until the subscribers the subscribers got to donating. And uh, Mara, instead of build, just building that peat latrine which would have been a wonderful thing in itself. He decided to, that maybe he knew about how much things cost because he's building a big, a massive villa right there in the village, right there in the village. That's one reason I'm sure this young lady had the nerve to finally ask him to, for, for help because she had been able to see how how wealthy this young man is how wealthy he is 
Look at the turtle, the little turtle walking about that tree out there. Can you see it? See the see the trees right by those grape vines, right by the scuppernine vines. I used to, I like to call them scuppernine. Scuppernine vines. See them going crawling past there? I don't even know how to zoom this camera. I don't know what I'm oh yeah, I don't I don't y'all can tell I don't know what I'm doing, people. <laughs> I'm a brand new YouTuber trying to learn to make videos because for one reason I was I was so inspired by the inspired by this village until I wanted to help do something about that village because let me let me finish the story some more uh, some more of the story but I'm not going to finish in this one video because it's such a large story and it's still going on today Oh yeah, instead of them, instead of Mara just building, building the Pete Latrine, after, after helping her, after helping the young lady go to school, he helped her go to school, paid the uh, fee for her to be able to go to school. And, uh, but after that, the, the, the subscribers kept donating and they found out that they needed a, a Pete Latrine bad, very badly. And, uh, and so, they kept donating and uh, Mara saw how instead of just building a Pete Latrine, why don't we build them a house? They needed it terribly bad. Where they were living, where they was living, it was, you know, in real bad shape. Mud house. I'm sure at one time in life it was brand new, you know, it was brand new one at one period in, in, of time. And uh, like I said, I don't know what I'm doing, so this battery might <laughs> die before I get through with this. But uh, anyway, maybe I'll see if I can continue in another one. And uh, but yeah, they kept donating and donating. They ended up building the people, the family, a house. Can you imagine? I'm sure my you gonna know. And uh, Mopopo, these the other two, another two villagers in that same village, they can understand, they can imagine, <laughs> because wonderful things are happening for them now, because of what Mara has done, and being available there in the village to help others. Now, since then, they've built the family a house. They built it in ten days. Can you imagine? They've built it in 10 days. And uh, Mayugano is a brick mason. He, he, he spearheaded the, the building after Mara got him involved. He was, he's Mara's, uh, what they call him? Uh, he's a master brick mason. He's a he's a bricklayer. He's a he's he's a master at it. And uh, so Mara got him involved. That's a little turtle still out there. Can you see it running, walking past the little vine right there? <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, they built him a house in ten days, y'all. Instead of building a, having to build a peat latrine outside, now they have an indoor toilet that they can use and enjoy and be able to take showers inside now instead of by the river, alongside the river in that village. And is it, can you imagine? That's amazing. And this all got done. That house got built in one week because of Mara's thoughts and on the situation and, and and wanting to help anyway uh, I am Mara is his YouTube channel I am underscore Mara and my Yuganos channel which he was very instrumental in building this this house for these this family his his where his uh, YouTube channel is, I am Mayugano, 
instead of an underscore, he just called his channel, I am Mayugano. And then his little, his, his helper, <laughs> they're so funny together, I'm telling you. I would go subscribe to these channels right now if I were you. If you want to laugh and enjoy seeing people improve their lives. It was subscribe to their channels and help them out. Support them, help support them. These are villagers, y'all. Villagers that, that, you know, the only information that we've gotten through the years here in America is that villagers are poor, they are needy, all the time with flies, all the time have flies flying around the children's mouths and 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 we've been getting a negative aspect of what's been going on in our mother in our motherland because that's where we are from here in America black people we are we are from Africa and uh I looked forward to going back, to having a chance to go back. Hopefully before I leave this world. But anyway, uh, I am a popo. Uh, not I am a popo, but just my popo. He liked to say, he liked to get that straight. My popo, just my popo. <laughs> These guys are, are hilarious, I'm telling you. If you want to laugh, Go ahead and subscribe to their channels, and uh, and and watch these guys grow and and prosper and, and progress. Okay, since then, uh, Mayugano's channel is is exploding, and Mapopos as well. They're 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 growing, and uh, since then, Mayugano has been able to purchase some land purchase an acre, acre of land there in the same village as Mara's villa. He's been able to purchase land and now he's building a, a house. He called it a store because he he's going to, I believe he's going to use it as storage after he built his, his, his main house. But now he's able to build a house and be able to stop renting. He's able to build a place for he, him and his two children that he had he's able to build a, a, a place for them to live and not have to rent anymore. It's that dumb. Can you imagine that? And so now he's building a house of his own. I tell you, there's so much giving going on in this village until they can't help but prosper because when you give, it comes back. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over. Do men give into your bosom because you give and you help. And you know, so that, these guys are working together. And there's also some more of them. <laughs> I mean, this, 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 this village is exploding with YouTubers since they decided to do this for this family. I tell you, it's, it's amazing and, and it's, it's wonderful. But anyway, they are steady prospering and growing. I think there's, there's over 50 YouTubers in that one village now. And so I'm looking forward to amazing things happening in this village. There's another YouTuber called himself, it's Nasto. It's Nasto. Nesto is 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 uh, helping to teach Mayugano and Mapopo English now, and so he's he's giving in that way, and his and they're helping each other. There's Mapopo, there's Mayugano, I am Mayugano, I am Mara. It's Nesto. Uh, Maja K, there's another one named Maja K. Maja K, I believe you, you pronounce it. But anyway, and then there's another young man called himself Philo the Boy. He's doing a wonderful work there. 
wonderful work. Help going around. Uh, when he see people that need something, he go and talk with them. And now he's going around blessing people in that same village. The village is growing and growing and growing in finances. Because if you can imagine getting, uh, being able to get receive U.S. dollars through YouTube in in a village in Africa, oh, it, it just multiplies. It's just multiplying what they can do financially. So, if you will, will you kindly go and uh, subscribe to their channels. Like I said, I, I don't, I'm not a YouTuber. I haven't been. I'm learning. And uh, I, I started this channel so I could help villagers around the world. I want to help villagers around the world receive even more than what they are receiving through YouTube. I have started this channel and uh, I had the idea, the thought to for all the YouTubers and all the villagers who subscribe to be able to, to just give these guys, these people, because there's some females too. There's one late, young lady called herself uh, Stella, Stella something. <laughs> but anyway, uh, you, you'll see, because they all help each other. You'll be able to see who I'm talking about. And, uh, and, and oh yeah, don't forget about uh, I am Morris, I am underscore Morris, sister, D. Mongrel. I mean, probably tearing that name apart, trying to pronounce it, but you'll, you'll learn more about it, about her. And uh, also their younger brother, Davy Jr. These guys, got it, they, they has it going on. And to be able to make that kind of money Receive that that kind of support in in a in a small village in Africa. Receive those dollars. It is something else. That some it's, there's a big change coming to their village. And I love since I've started watching these videos, I love the idea of village rather than neighborhood. I've been enjoying uh, YouTubers videos from Africa. Uh, for years now and uh, there's another great YouTuber called himself Walter Meyer Walter Meyer has now he has he was he, he was making videos in China and now he decided to go back to Africa and, and make videos and his channel has blown up to the last time I looked was over 1.3 million subscribers wow can you imagine and he's making that type of money in africa wow and so anyway another another one of the youtubers let's see what their what's their name uh hmm anyway it'll come back to me maybe i'll put it in another video some more some more names in another video and because i'm because i'm trying to become very good at this that's that's that little turtle over there again can you imagine look at the little turtle about in the middle of the screen right right a little bit past the little uh fire pit that we have there a little <laughs> What do you call them? Chimney, whatever, whatever you call those things. It took me a, about five hours to put it together years ago. <laughs> but anyway, I'm putting. I got my finger. See that? I got my finger in the video, y'all. I had my finger in the video. I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe somebody can drop some comments in <laughs> in the comment section, as these guys always say, so that uh, I can learn a few things. And uh, but anyway. If you will kindly subscribe to my channel that I've started. I don't know when I'll get this video out, but anyway, 
subscribe to my channel as well. Oh yeah, the name that I put on it that I have is Scent Flicks. Uh, let's see what I call it, a uh, village. Scent Flicks. Uh, anyway, you'll see it. <laughs> I can't even think of the name of it right now. But you'll see it. But anyway, people, y'all kindly subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be uploading some more videos because I have, I'm on a mission to help YouTubers around the world, and villages, village YouTubers around the world to grow their channels, make more income as they gain more and more support from people like yourself. So go on, kindly subscribe and help these guys out. Maybe I'll try to look up some of these other YouTubers' names. and But you, you, you'll learn about them, though, because they all join together. They, they uh, what they call it, uh, co they collaborate. They collaborate with each other and, and help each other's channels grow. Mara had a, had, I am Mara had a negative, uh, something negative happened to him. One of the people, one of the YouTubers that he helped, I saw him make a video about this YouTuber, just because Mara, see Mara was, he's a busy man, building a big mansion, helping people. And uh, he, since he didn't have time this, on this day or whatever it was, to help this other YouTuber that he had helped get started. He had, I think he helped him, he usually helped people get over a thousand subscribers in their first couple of days, few days, because he has so many. Oh yeah, he's on his way to 500,000 subscribers the last I heard, one of the last times I heard them talk about it. He's up going up to over 500. He's headed towards, like they always say, they're moving towards 500,000. But anyway, <laughs> that's um, that's amazing. That's can you imagine all it you know what he has going on and what he's able to do? Last time I saw his, one of his videos, he was here in America. But anyway, uh, help these guys out. Help the, help support these these people as they grow their, their YouTube channels. There is work, there is hard work involved. There's, well, there's considerable work involved in making videos and editing them and uploading them. But mine are gonna be pretty raw starting out <laughs> because I don't know how to edit yet or anything like that. But, so mine are gonna be pretty, pretty raw. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoying this rain that I'm showing you. It's steady coming down. You can probably hit a thunder as well. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut this, cut this off and uh, see if I can figure out how to upload it. <laughs> but anyway, it's a beautiful day. Even in the rain, it's a beautiful day. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you've watched it to the end. I'll think of some more of those names and maybe hopefully mention it in my next video. So if you will kindly subscribe as you subscribe to their channels and support them. Thank you for watching. I'll be talking with you later. <laughs>